if there aren't black engineers here at U of I, I honestly don't know where they're at. Maybe they're like at the MITs or like the Berkeley, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like they're probably there because they probably got more money or they probably got more outreach from those colleges, to be completely honest. Like, I don't know where they are. My name is Chineza Ifoma Okosi, and I am a sophomore looking into industrial engineering. I'm currently undeclared, and I am from South Holland, Illinois. I feel like this campus isn't inclusive at all. It's definitely immensely diverse, but when those diversities don't interact, it doesn't, it doesn't become inclusion. It's just a whole bunch of people of different skin colors that are just coexisting, but they're not interacting, so it doesn't really matter. It feels good, and it feels bad to be a black woman on this campus. Like, I feel empowered because I'm like one of a kind, so to speak, but then I sort of feel discouraged because there's not many people like me. I, I feel like they don't know that it's possible for minorities to do it, and it's probably like, not something that has been like pushed upon them. You know what I'm saying? So we could definitely fix that, like starting early, you know, like letting kids know about like how, how like productive and how beneficial like majoring in like a math or like science or like one of the STEM majors can be. And like telling them like young, young, not just like high school, cause like, even high school is a little bit too late. You know what I'm saying? But like more like middle school, even elementary school. So like they have it in their mind that, okay, maybe math is a possibility. You know, I just feel like they think it's too, they might think it's too hard or just too unattainable. But if you show them that it is definitely attainable, then I feel like, you know, they have more of a chance. I do feel isolated sometimes just in classes. Like other than that, I don't really care. Like. It has nothing to do with me what the next person thinks about me but just like in classes when you're trying to do like a group you know collaboration and then it's just like oh let's not listen to the black girl she doesn't know what she's talking about when it ends up like oh huh, I told you so so I just move past those microaggressions by saying F it I mean every now and then I might just like go off on someone but once you let someone control how you feel like they become your god and I'll be damned if I have somebody else be my god you know what I'm saying I have one god and that's the only person I answer to. 